And again, then you yeah. get into the whole uh, methods of rhetoric, uh, something that we also know, uh, which is about uh, everything from body language to intonation to repetition uh, and gesticulation, the way you hold yourself, your posture, your hand movements. Um, and then, of course, a lot of people will be talking about symbolism and weird signs being used to convey secret dollars. But, but that's beside the point. The point is really about, um, <laughs> about um, getting the attention of your audience. Exactly. And can I do a quick? Can I do a quick grammar joke? I mean, and you did a couple of logic ones. Yes. Just so we don't lose the crowd. Um, I think it goes a little bit something like this. Oh, excuse me, Miss. Do you know the difference between fellatio and fettuccine? And if not, can I buy you a pizza? <laughs> uh, I like the one where there is one O type of people in the world, the ones that understand binary and the ones that don't. <laughs> right. Oh, man. There's just so many of these things, and again, this is about the fact that 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 the trivium is so natural. Mm -hmm. You just need to play with it. You just need to say, okay, this is not dangerous. And the same goes with all the fucking quackademics in the world, and especially mm -hmm. when they start talking about whether Aristotle says this or Aristotle says that or Plato says this or Plato says that. How about giving them the finger and saying, I'm going to go read it myself. <laughs> Well, or, or, or watch the right YouTube videos and you can get it that way also. Well, that would be the, the, the lazy boy version. But really, it's, it's funny, right? Because when it comes to the classics, this is something that most people don't really think about, right? This gets me a bit into the whole copyright thing. You can get it all for free. It's out there and it's been printed for hundreds of years. So it's not like it's going to be difficult to find this in a bookstore. Not yet. They, they they are not that hard to get a hold of. Of course, if you get if you try and and and, and find something extremely obscure, it, it, it's going <laughs> to we'll do that again. <laughs> it, it, it's it's going to be hard. Um, but um, but there's just a, a lot of these books are really printed in so many fucking editions that this it's not going to be a problem getting a hold of them. And and well, what, what, I'm not going to say that. Uh, I'm not going to do an Umberto Eco and saying that everyone needs a library, but but it's funny. It's more fun than collecting stamps, and at least hey, hey, well, wait, what kind of comparison is that? Who the fuck collects stamps these days? Yeah, anyway? or action figures or Barbie dolls. I don't know what people. Oh, I'll, collect. I'll give some useful. It's much more fun than wanking. I mean, believe it or not, it is it beats the shit out of it. Yeah, if you do it together, if it. you do it together, then you get sticky pages. 